there are museums in world cities across the planet looking at how to understand and respond to migration more and more as a key issue. Motoroti says our content is migration and our form is art. So the theme of migration runs like a stick of rock through everything we do. History is about us, so therefore it shouldn't be just um, the domain of historians or curators or so forth, because we're all part and parcel of making history. The idea of bringing artists in to connect these institutions to communities was very new and very fresh. Moti Roti delivered a project called Priceless. We identified objects within each of those institutions and then brought community groups to engage with them and did a range of different artistic presentations. London is a fantastic place. It is made up of so many different communities. to make sure that we have created a platform whereby people feel that they can discuss and understand and broaden, you know, even our understanding of this history. Artists aren't constrained by some of the things that constrain us as curators when we're interpreting a historical object. They often make connections that a museum curator looking at it from a very linear historical point of view might not see. We've completed a project called Streets of Gold with the Museum of London that was an exhibition that ran in the Museum of London Sackler Hall. Streets of Gold invited several artists who had migrated to London from across the world to engage with the Museum of London's collection and to find objects within it that resonated with their own biographies and artistic practice. And then to make hybrid artworks that themselves included these objects as part of their composition. London has a central dichotomy. It's both thrilling and frustrating, and it can take a long time to find the fabled gold that must be buried in the streets. Museums being museums, we've got a quite sort of corporate, business-like way of doing things. But I do think with our partnerships as well that we get people on board, we do something with them and then we sort of drop them on there. So sort of somebody in the middle who could take a more longer-term view and nurture relationships over a bit of a longer time might be quite good. Roti definitely helped in that sense that they were effectively looking after the artists and our main um, communication line was with Moti Roti. It's like with all partnerships, the best partnerships are the ones where the partner really brings you something that you haven't got yourself. I guess it's by both having this really firm set of producer methodologies but at the same time having this passion for allowing artists who get migration and internationalism as creative themes and bringing those together that we feel we have something very significant to offer.